Hello everybody, my name is Markiplier and welcome to Fran Bow. Now I played the demo for this game a long time ago and it really impressed me because it was a point and click style adventure horror game that had really surreal, bizarre and grotesque environments and a lot of really weird things that were going on and it really impressed me in the demo and I'd been waiting for it forever. Everything's fine. It feels like heaven. Doesn't look like heaven. I see my parents. They look so happy. They have a present for me. I wonder. It's a cat, so sweet and pretty. Dark as the deepest night. It's Mr. Midnight. My best friend. My only friend. We're having dinner and I see Aunt Grace too. I really like her a lot. It's Friday. My parents are going out. Aunt Grace takes good care of me. We are having so much fun. It's Monday night. I'm playing with Mr. Midnight, but something feels real bad. Oh, hi. A strange creature outside my window. I don't like it. It scares me. Suddenly I hear something. It's mom, screaming. I want to know what's wrong. A bright light shines from my parents' room. I go closer. And closer. Mom? Dad? Please don't. Mommy? Daddy? I can't quite roll. Fran, please, follow my voice. On the count of three, you will wake up. One. Two. Hey, there we are. Okay. Three. Hello, hi doc. Fran, how do you feel? I feel terrible considering everything that I just saw. I feel like dying, probably. Uh, B? Huh? Okay. I feel like dying. I don't understand why you make me do this. Try to calm down. This is part of your recovery. My parents are dead! Recovery? Don't you get it? My parents are dead! Oh, poor thing. Everything will get better, I promise. Better? Then let me go. That would be better. You should not tell me how to do my job. Well, maybe you should do your job a little better! But now I have something for you, Fran. Oh, really? I decided to give a little sass on this one. See the desk? There's a little package for you. It's from Aunt Grace. Take it. Okay. Cool. This was my mother's purse. What's inside your mother's purse? Open it. There's something inside. Ah. Uh, examine? Dearest Fran, here is the purse you like so much. I thought you would like to have it. When I was thinking about you, I remembered that you like to examine objects and combine them with other things. So I hope you'll always keep this purse and give it and all the other things you find a good use. Never forget that creativity is absolutely the greatest gift you have. Love, Aunt Grace. She is worried about you. 
See, I'm worried too. Because I'm not crazy and still here. Stop it! You are out of control, young lady! Can I leave now? Can I go to my room, please? Yes, you can leave. But before you do, it is time for your medicine. I don't want to try more medicine! It's called Duotine, and it will make you feel very relaxed. Nurse, we're ready. Oh, hey, nurse. How's it going? I don't trust you very much. Anything new today, Dr. Dearn? Nothing, actually. Same visions as before. Oh, I see. Here, Fran, take your medicine. I don't do women's voices very well. I tend to give them all very, very deep voices. Oh, boy. I re- I rem- I remember this from the demo! I don't feel good. Oh, 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 God! Oh, oh, no, take her back to her room. And nurse, don't let her take this ever again. Yeah, she kind of had a bad experience from that. But I get a feeling that I need to take a lot more of that medicine as the game progresses. Now, I remember a lot of this from the demo, but they did change around a few things. Beware, Frambo. If you leave the House of Madness, I will hunt you down, catch you, and bring you back to insanity. Oh, that's so sad. Fran, wake up! Oh, the poor little kitty wants to help. The medicine will help you escape. I'll be waiting for you in the forest. Thank you, Mr. Midnight, but why weren't you- oh. I love you. Is Mr. Midnight gonna secretly be the evil entity that's haunting my life? Hmm. Chapter 1, My Sober Day. See, there's a lot of interesting things about this game besides the grotesqueness of what the environments show and what the, the what happens to Fran Bo. That is all fantastic about the game, too. I love that. It's so, like, oh, it makes you not- oh, I have to get out of here. Oh, okay. I, mu I must have missed the first one. Something about getting out. But, I, like, I love this game because when I played the demo, it was so interesting and interactive. I mean, I played a lot of point and click before, but this one took it to a different level because I, I don't know if I compared it to Alice in Wonderland yet, but I wanted to because it kind of had that feel of going down the rabbit hole and exploring an entire environment in a world filled with madness where not everyone is mad in there. The patient was found near the Oswald Asylum showing signs of psychosis. The bowed dagger family tragedy. Details omitted. Treatment. Dr. Marcel Dearn has tried different medications and all have been cancelled because of side effects. Psycho- what? I'm not that for sure! Man, only 10 years old and already diagnosed with psychosis. Locked. Good reason to get curious. I will get your nose. I will get it. Oh, okay. I didn't know that was gonna be playful. <laughs> Are you a happy clown? Can you make me laugh? I'm having a hard time laughing again. I will get your nose. Oh, that's so kind of sad. Hopefully this won't fall on my head while I'm sleeping. Well, that almost guarantees that's going to happen. I love how, like, everything is just grotesque. It's awesome. Red and tiny, you are hiding from me. Oh, you want the medicine. I hate the monster. I have to find Mr. Midnight. I have to find him now. I miss my kitty. He hides because he is afraid. He told me that the medicine would show me where he is. Well, that doesn't sound very good at all! That leads me to think that, you know, I will find you, Mr. Midnight. Oh, boy. Don't be afraid, my dear kitty. Everything will be just fine. That makes me think more and more that it's not good for you, and that actually Mr. Midnight might be a bad influence. Oh! Holy moly! Something fell! A handy hook. I'll save it to play pirate later. Probably not. Oh, sweet, sweet melody. I saw- I kind of forgot that the character, even though I just read that she was ten years old, I kind of forgot that she is just a ten-year-old girl wandering through this weird place. My legs are just fine. Empty bottle, empty glasses, nothing useful. Towels, towels, I don't need towels. Let's see. Hello, hi. Oh, I want to know what she's writing, I'm curious. I guess the nurse would let, never let me- Touch anything, excuse me, sorry. Oh, Fran, you're awake, good. How long was I asleep? Three days, maybe. Was it the medicine? That made me sleepy? Yes, it was the medicine. That's why you're not taking it anymore. Lady Nurse, I did something. See? You are nothing but trouble. What is it? 
Mm, broke the curtains. I was trying to look outside and I accidentally broke the curtains. <laughs> accidentally. I have to fix this. Follow me. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. I don't feel like following you, though. Let's see. I better go and talk to her. Oh, okay. All right, then. Hello. Something is missing. Have you seen the hook that holds the curtains? See nothing. No, miss. I haven't seen anything. Well, I have to go and find something to fix this, you little girl. Okay, thank you. I can feel the love pouring out from your cold, stony heart. All right, fine, then. Ooh. Whoa. That is cool. I also like the art style. It's very simplistic, but also it leads, or it lends itself to the atmosphere that it's trying to create. Tower defense. Or is it defense tower? Oh, I guess I, that is my way out. Okay. So now that she left, I should be able to find something on her desk. What do we got here? Oh, I'll keep these patches to stop blood, because I plan on bleeding a whole lot later. Violent trauma can have a great impact on children, totally changing their normal lives. For example, children damaged by trauma can have mild to severe deficits in some abilities, such as trusting people near them, seeing the world as a safe place, making decisions, etc. Because of these effects, some traumas can lead to several symptoms of major mental illness. For example, not trusting other people or not feeling safe in the world. This can be interpreted as paranoia. Okay, traumas, traumas, trauma is the word doctors love to say. Hee <laughs> hee, that brain looks like a turtle. Dang, she really is just a child, it's sad. The patient has been sleeping almost all the time. She only wakes up to drink water, but I don't think she remembers that. After drinking, she goes back to sleep again. She hasn't been s social for three days either. Some kids have come around and asked about her and when she would come out and play. Okay, Justine 8H? Is that a clue for something? Okay, there's handwriting is awful. No doubt, okay. Pills, pills, hide. Oh, I know what that is. Okay, whoa. Why is there a gun there? Seriously, why is there a gun there? All right, good. All right, so 8H, so this is just saying that the numbers are the code, so I can open up that if I just assign the numbers to the thing. Okay, examine it. My pills are inside, I know it. I have to crack the code. Okay, so. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. I. Shaisa. A, B, C, D. A, B, C, D, E. Done, done. Okay. The pills. Kitty told me these would help me. All right, cool then. Do I have an unlimited supply and do I actually want to take them is the question. Yep, yes I do. Oh, hey! How's it going there? Whoa! Hi! Holy crap. You got a little blood on your mouth. Are you okay? Oh my god. Oh my god, that's so weird. Get out, creepy creature! What are you, huh? Tell me. Okay. Empty bottle, empty glass, alright. Hello, Miss Nurse! How, how are you doing? Oh, okay. Excuse me, Lady Nurse, this may be very useful. <sighs> oh man, but I love it so much. I love how grotesque it is. It's so cool. I was just wondering if these show any different view. Oh, they do. Whoa, there's a handprint on the window. Ah, the playground. Good night, trees and moon. I'm pretty sure the playground isn't a good escape route. I like the bunny swing thing. It makes me feel dizzy. Oh, that is so weird. Okay, let me try just this mirror or this window here and then I'll move on. Oh. I'm not so easy to th see through this. Good, okay. So now I can carry on. Oh, that's so bizarre. Oh my god, hi! How's it going there? Oh, oh! That's my head! Oh, is that my head? Give me my head back, please! Good god, this is so weird! Oh, this is so weird! Oh, man. I, I adore this. This is so cool. Oh, you're sleeping, sweet bunny? Bunny, wake up! Oh, that's sad now. <laughs> What happened to the clown? Where'd the clown go? I hope he's not around here. Oh god, no! It looks like he escaped from the pa- That's not good! I don't want to meet the clown! Okay. What does it say now? Who did it? Uh, that's the good question. Who did it? It was not me. But now there seems to be a way down. Oh, hi. Oh, to happiness. Oh, to happiness, bull. Oh, a secret box. Shh. Hey, I'm the one who shushes around here. I don't know, need any of the dark voices to shush me. Why are you looking at me like that? You terrify me. What is that black thing sitting next to you? 
You can see. The patient came to Oswald Asylum with his mother. The boy has developed paranoid behavior paranoia not yet diagnosed. Ugh. Oh, wouldn't Mr. Horse, are you having a good time? I'm not having the best time in the world. Oh, no, your head. I'll try to put your head back on. Oh, well, I'm sorry. I can't help you, Mr. Deer. I tried my best. Okay, so that one's locked, so... There's bound to be something down here. Like, the extent of the demo that I played kinda had some elements of what we're seeing here, but not all. No, absolutely not! You can't tell her that. But she has to know! You can't keep her away from me! The reason is more than clear, Grace. No, it's not! I want to take her home now! You can't. Fran's mental condition is not appropriate yet. I am- I'm guessing that's Aunt Grace. And I have no idea what happened in the- oh. Hi, why am I here now? Was that real? Oh dear Aunt Grace. I wonder what she has to tell me. The doctor has no soul. I'm going home tonight! Alright then. What does this fox say? Foxy fox, don't cry. <laughs> oh no. Use my hand as a tissue. Would you like a hug? Oh god. That's so sad. That's so weird. Alright, let's see what we can do. Uh, was that doll there before? I don't quite remember. Let's see, I used to have a blue dress like yours. I can't play with you now, I'm on a very secret mission. Okay, so maybe I can use one of the items that I have if I combine... Combine the knitting needle with the little box. Uh, it won't do. Okay, negative. Wait. Okay, alright, then... Never mind, I'm gonna use this, try to use it on that. Almost, but there's another hole. I need something else. Okay, so the hook combined with this little box is- Oh, it's open! Oh, okay! Oh! Oh, cool! I have a key! I didn't know that I could just that easily get a key! Oh, was this drawer locked? Was that the thing? I think I remember- Yeah, okay. So this key must go to this. Oink! Yeah, there we go! Uh, there's something inside. Oh, a bobby pin! A, a picture? <laughs> oh god, that's so disturbing. Oh, I'm not okay with that. I am not okay with that. All right, let's carry on. So now that we have the bobby pin, we should be able to do something with it. Combine it with this? Yeah, there we go. Okay, so use this on the door and apparently a ten-year-old can pick locks. Let's go. Oh. Fran, wait! Oh, okay, I snapped out of it. Hello? Are you leaving tonight? Yeah, baby? I will if you help me. I will if you help me. The only thing I know is that the office is the key. The key? Is there a key inside the office? I saw the doctor write a secret code. A secret code? To open the yellow door? He doesn't want me to tell you. Who? Who? Him? You mean the bl- oh. Whoa! Hey! Yo! Hi! All doors are closed. You are prisoner of my games. And nobody will help you escape. Okay. Cool. That's interesting. Leave me alone. I hate you. Oh, that's so sad. Mommy, Daddy, I need you so much right now. No, I won't let that monster stop me. You go, girl! You show them who's boss! You show that nurse who's boss. You know what's going on. Okay. I think this is just about the extent of the demo, but things are still radically different than what the demo actually was portraying. The maze! We never get to play there. Whoa, tonight the fog is pretty thick. How can you tell? It's barely crossed the horizon. Okay, I wish I could get lost in there. Okay, so there's another door open here. Hi, you look fun. Another clown, oh boy! Hello! You see them! You do, right? What? See what? The creatures that follow everyone. The shadows? You mean the shadows? Uh-huh. I can't see them, but I know they're there. See, I wish I didn't see them. You like to draw? I love to draw. Let me just change the subject on everything. I love it too. But tell me more about the shadows. Crayon! A crayon. I want to find a crayon. I draw all the time. You have crayons right next to you, little girl. I want to- what are you drawing? Huh? S something That's very helpful, thank you. What is it? My dreams! 
go now! Okay, fine then. Maybe you could try to find something else around here. Oh, real flowers, they smell so sweet. The patient was a victim of sexual abuse by an unknown person which almost killed her. This event created auditory hallucinations and thought disorder. Oh, that's so horrible. Oh, this is one of those mute clowns. How do you know it's a mute clown? How can you even tell? You mean a mime? Okay. Oh, let me see. A red puppet and a serpent, a teddy and many other things. Okay. So what about these crayons here? That's mine! MY CRAYONS! Can I have it? I just like this green crayon so much, can I have it? No! I won't be able to grow it green then! That's ridiculous! I can't give it to you. But you have so many! Come on! Yes, many colors, but you know they don't like me drawing. Wait, well then why do you draw so much? Who? Who does? Who? The nurses. They tie me up and when I want to draw, I can't. The nurses are crazy. When I can't draw, I hurt myself. Then comes the red milk? Look, no- Oh no! Oh god! Oh, that's so horrible! Oh man. Please cure me, yes? And stop the red milk. Let's see what I can do. Oh. Let's take a pop a pill. Oh, Booski! Oh. <laughs> Why do you look like a fabric doll? Oh, God, it's so horrible. Tiny, tiny hands all over you eating your soul. That's a rather dark thing to say. Where'd the clown go? I don't know. Maybe somewhere. Even the purest things die in this place. I think I found the clown. I don't want to touch it, it's a clown from the painting. Go on, maybe if I touch it, it will jump and scare me a lot. Mm, all right, nothing happened, it must be dead. Alrighty then, I'll just... I'll be on my way. Goodbye. Oh! Hi! What was that? I don't know! Daddy was not there. Mommy would not care. That's weird as hell. Good God. Hello, this wasn't blocked up before. Okay. Hi. You're my beloved friend. Bip, bip. Okay. If you want to hug me, try to catch me. If you can't catch me, it's because you haven't found me. Bip, bip, murder, murder. Okay. Whoo. Oh, this is weird. Okay. The king likes drawing. Who's the king? I don't- Ooh! Ooh. Alrighty then. Somebody wrote something here. Interesting. Okay. I can't do much else besides that. Bip, bip, brrr. What? This wasn't here before. you damn right it wasn't. So did the pills just wear off after a while, or do they- Do I have to actually, like, sit here for a while and- Or do I actually have to take another or something? Oh, man. Okay. Ugh. Okay, so I gotta make the pill wear off, I think. And that way I'll be able to go down the staircase that was there before. God, it's so horrific. Everything about it is just horrific. Uh, anyway. Alright, so let me try. Oh, oh, okay. So all I do is I, I close the pill bottle and that does that. Oh, hey, 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 hey! Oh, there you are. You should be in your room. The door was closed. But you left it open. I'm sure it was not open. I know because I locked it. How did I get out then? It was open, old lady. Don't try to trick me. Go inside your room and wait for the doctor. Okay, I think I looked at everything I needed to. Oh, I don't have time for this. I need to find my way out. Oh, I thought- Oh! Oh, okay. All right, I get it. So there's another piece of the puzzle. Oh, hey, how's it going? Never mind. Did you break out from your room? That's not nice, Fran. But I'm hungry, sir. I haven't eaten in days. I won't listen to any of your excuses, young lady. No food for the rest of your life. Let's see. Sir Doctor, please just let me go out and eat something. You have to learn how to listen to those in charge. Of course, sir. Lesson learnt. Just don't do it again, Fran. Go and eat now, then get back to bed. Thanks, doctor. This is almost abuse, but I love you or something. Whatever you want to hear, go screw yourself. All right, 
Let's see if I can get down to the cafeteria. This Actually, let me see what's in this first. Still spoopy. The throne is empty. Ugh. I didn't realize that anyone could see me pooping. <laughs> Gross! Oh, this is the only one? Ugh. Gross. Oh, hello! Hi! Sir Oswald Harrison, a bearded old man. This gate is very locked. I wonder what that blinking light is for. That signs show where things are in the hospital. The reception room, you always find a nurse in there. Okay. Hello, sir. How's it going? I'll get with you in just a second. Hey, get your hand off the office door! Let's see. Annie Schultz, Daniel Gosman. Phil was here today. Phil was here today. That seems to be the only thing that she cares about. Phil was here. Who's Philmore Bronston then? Hi, sir. How you doing? Sir, the key hanging up there. Can I have it? Here, yeah, if I could give you the key, if you could give me- Oh, God. Oh, God. What a bastard. You can kiss your butt. That is really weird. Ugh. I can't reach those tiny windows. Okay, then. If I call emergency, I don't think they would help me. This table isn't interesting at all. Fine, I'll go get something to eat, then. Hello? Hi? Hello, are you alright? What is that supposed to mean? I wanted to know. I just wanted to know if you feel okay. I don't want to tell. The doctor will cut your head open if you don't leave. He likes to eat brains. He already took mine. He ate all my thoughts. He ate your brain? He will eat yours too! I saw you inside the doctor's office. You were dead. Oh no! Then I have to go. I hope you find new thoughts. Bye bye Okay, a little weird. But not the weirdest thing that I've seen so far. Hello, Isabel. Would you like to help me escape? Good night, shiny toys. Elephant sir, you are very pink and soft. Clowns on the walls in the house of madness. Your tiny hat is Sometimes she says things that are actually quite profound and interesting, and then other times very much not. What are you doing, kid? I have no idea what you're doing. Hello, what are you doing? It doesn't work. The paper's not working. What do you mean? The paper should be working like they told me. What does the paper do? I need the paper to show me what's on the television. Oh, I see, but why isn't it working? The waves must be powerful. Change the channel, please. Okay. I'll try my best. Clickety-click. How about that one? Doop. Oink. Human testing approved. Oh, good! Uh... How about that one? That one seems like a fun one. It works! It works! A miracle! Thank you! Paper vision positive! Great, can I see? No, this is mine. If you want, you can take the papers that didn't work. I suppose I can use it. Oh, thank you for your grace's help. I'm busy. Paper vision revision in action. Okay, thank you. A little paper boat. Take me to the sea and beyond. The action men. Could either of you help me find my kitty? I don't know. I imagine that when I take this pill, it's not going to help very much. Pink sash is now mine. Let me examine this while I'm not on the pill. Well, that looks borderline nice. Hi oh! Ah! Oh no! They did it all wrong! They cut your head into little pieces! Please take me out of here. Please take me out of here. Oh my god. Oh, that's so weird. Oh, 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 whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh, 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 I see that. I see that. Oh, you can't fool me. Oh, that is so creepy. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. No, 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 Okay. Let's see here. Look at me. I say I care while you're dying of hunger and thirst. What? Hello. How's it going, Isabel? Wake up, Isabel. The black shadow is touching you. It says that you're going to die soon. Are you afraid of death? I hope not, because it may happen even if you don't like it. Oh, man. This... Oh. 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 I will laugh at you. Why? 
I will lie to you. I will hide you inside the shadows. Oh no. Teddy, what are you doing here? Are you on your way to meet another Teddy? I don't think so. Say hello from me when you get there. Oh. Oh. Oh, so dark and creepy. So dark and creepy. Oh no, the lady nurse died. I wonder who did this. It wasn't me. Ugh. The grandfather clock is big and grand. Not that big. What have we here? Chocolate. Mmm, yummy. I don't like the bitter coffee. Menu of the day is pasta. It's weird. Mommy loved to paint roses. I don't like this painting. It feels like Mr. Oswald is staring. Mr. Midnight, are you here? They hide you because they love you. I don't know what that means. They harm you because they hate you. Oh, little boy, everyone feels ashamed of you. Is that the shadow speaking to me, or is am I am I she speaking to the shadow there? Oh, hi. <laughs> How's it going? They are dead. Birdie bird, I like you. That holy man took all your clothes off. Oh, how pretty all the roses are, right? Your mommy doesn't believe you. Oh, God. Please tell me if you can hear me. Why do you have this creature next to you? He's staring at you. Maybe he wants to eat you. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> oh, God. It's so gross. Ugh. This door is always locked at night. I can't go out and play. Let's, let's, oh, okay. Everything's back to normal now. Goody, goody gumdrops. Annie loves to drink the milk like a kitten. Don't touch my sword. Okay. I didn't know it was yours. You should bow and speak clearly to me. I am your king. I bow to you, sir. Very well, my child. What is the purpose of your visit? I want your cane, sir. What walking cane? Do you mean my sword? Yes, your highness, your sword. What would you give me in exchange? Anything you need, your highness. Maybe a crayon, because the king likes to drink. Bring me a castle and a horse! Only then will I grant you my sword. But don't you like to draw? Maybe you'd like to draw. I thought you were hungry. Hmm. Okay. Then there has to be another way around. L first, let me see if I can look out the windows first. Any clues? It's just a playground. Okay. So if I carry on over here... Oh! Hey, everyone's here! Hello! Hello, are you new here? I haven't seen you before. No. Are you from downstairs? Uh-huh. They think I'm better now. What's your name? Could you please kill me? Whoa, okay. That's a bit of a No! I have to go. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye now. Hello. Hey, Annie. How are you? Aren't you afraid of me? N not particularly. Why? Because I can do magical tricks and make you sleepy. I didn't know you could. Magic tricks? Show me! Show you, but it's very scary. It's better if you do it. I can't. I'm not a magician. I can give you the magical stuff. Really? Whoa. Yes, the magical stuff that will make anyone fall asleep. That's amazing, powerful, and grand. Here is a gift. Take it. Slowly. Oh. Oh, okay. How does it work? I'm guessing I sprinkle in the, this in someone's food, and they go to sleep. Magical fairy dust and all that. Okay, bye, Annie. Stop looking so permanently shocked all the time. Okay, so that's all the time that I have for this episode. I hope you guys are enjoying this. This is so intriguing. Like, just the level of detail in the story. I know it, it, it like, is a point-and-click adventure, so that kind of leads itself to what the thing that it is. But it's just so interesting to see. So, let me know what you think of this game down in the comments below. Let me know if you're enjoying it. And thank you, everybody, so much for watching. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye! Didn't get burned. Oh, everything's great. Choo-choo, here comes the happy train.